Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're just going to be playing around with an easy Halloween look. Definitely focusing more on purples, but honestly, whatever you have in your collection, this is like a quick going to work, want to be cute, do something crazy type of look. Um, you can definitely substitute the darker colors I use for lighter colors. You can substitute the purple for orange, green, whatever you're feeling, whatever you have. Um, I have already done my foundation and bronzer, so I used a little bit more of a full coverage foundation just because this is going to be more of a Halloween look. And then also I have already prepped my eyelids with the NYX primer. So first of all, I'm just going to start off by using the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Pencil in Zoodoo. Don't know if this one's available anymore, but like I said, whatever you have is what you should use. So I'm just going to start off by placing that. This is just going to be a base for the eyeshadow. We're going to blend it in a little bit. So just kind of put that on the outer edge of the eye. And then we're also going to use that under the eye, but not quite yet. And then we are just going to use more of a flat shader, or not a flat shader, more of a pencil brush just to blend that out. So we're just going to blend it into the outer V, kind of painting on where you want it. Again, does not need to be perfect. Alright, and then, going into Jackson Hill palette, we're actually going to pick up this dark plum color down here. with an angled shading brush. Tapping off the excess. Okay, then with a fluffy brush, we're going to go into any neutral brown color, dabbing that off, and then just blending out the outer edges, and then bringing it into the crease. You can do this with a solid black, you can do this. Really, with like I said, any color, any greens, whatever you have on hand, go for it. Alright, then we're going to go back into the pencil brush we used before, and we're going to tap into this purple shade. I'm just rolling it. Then we're going to start blending the inner section into about halfway of the lid. And the same thing to the other eye. Then we're going to go into a little bit more of a stiffer blending brush, and we're going to dip right into this brown right here. It's a little warmer. And again, just working more on blending. Then 
Then we're going to go into a liner brush, picking up that same dark purple shade that we picked up before. We're going to just stamp that onto the lower lash, just the outer portion of that, and bring it straight up. And then just connecting that into the outer crease. Same thing on the other eye. Then we're going to go into same brush again, same color, pack the color onto that V. going in with a blending brush, just kind of buffing out any mistakes that were made. You can also go in with your beauty blender you used for your foundation. Alright, then we're going to go in with a little bit of a concealer. I'm just using Tarte Shape Tape, but you can use whatever concealer you want. Going in with a flat brush, picking up a little bit of that concealer, placing that into this inner corner. just like that and same on the other side bringing it a little bit onto that purple that we just applied then we just take a flat shader brush and pat that in And then we're going to go back in with that shimmery purple color and just try to really just fade the fake cut crease in with the dark purple color. Alright, now that we have that down, I'm going to take, I'm just going to wipe the flat shader brush off that we had had and go into the Revolution Pro HD palette. Looks like that thing is huge. I'm going to go in with this kind of fuchsia purpley pinky color, but I am going to get my brush a little wet. Usually I would literally just use my sink, but I'm going to use that for now because it's here. 
and just kind of mixing that up, mixing that up, and placing that exactly where the concealer is. that in place and then I go back into the neutral brown color we used before and just blend all that crease out. Now we're going to go back into the purple eyeliner, put running that along our waterline. Then going back in with the pencil brush, going into that shimmery purple shade, and just running that all underneath. Then going in with a very, very small shader brush, going in with oops, this first shade of the Jaclyn Hill palette, just for an inner corner highlight. Brushing away any fallout. Going back in with the stiffer blending brush, blending everything underneath out. Then we're going to go in with a liquid liner. This is just a sample size of the Kat Von D. Gonna wing it out just a little bit. I'm gonna curl the lashes. Applying the L'Oreal Lash Paradise.
All right, and then for lips, we are just going to use a NYX lip liner in pale pink. Then we're going to use a Sephora Rouge Cream Lip Stain in the color 35. So again, sticking with the purple. And you can pop on some lashes, totally up to you, um, use whatever colors like I said, but we're all finished for today guys, I hope you guys have a happy Halloween, bye!